Hello and welcome back to Anvil Place. So I restarted my f recording software just for safety's sake. And we're back to playing. It's still the same play session. So I haven't seen any comments or anything. Let's go check the war table. Let's see. I'm sorry for not finishing the Darkspawn uh, quest. But I couldn't find it and then it was kind of like, I mean if I'm gonna spend an episode looking for each and every one of those tunnels eh, Maybe not do it then. I mean this series always like is already like 70 episodes long Last I checked I think this will be episode 74 That's a lot That's that's way too much because like Mass Effect 2 by comparison you know, is only like 54 and that's the entire game so yeah I'm, I'm going to do to slow down on the uh, on the side quests a bit I'm going to do companion quests now uh, I think Cassandra's companion quest is the one looking for the seekers so we have to do that and then I think we're going to do uh, what is this power quiet power 20 my Go all from the windows are hiring right. Large number of mages trying westward to excavate excavate something of great value or cause. The Inquisition must find whatever its enemies are searching for. Where is the queen? Assassin's talking the Empress. I thought I had 30 power. Okay. Perlin. Ambassador Jotovin, I regret to inform you that Matt just said Cameron was discovered dead in his home this morning and what the guys believe was a grisly reenactment of a scene from some pin dreadful called Heart in High Town. I do not know what interesting Inquisition had in the matter, nor do I want to know. Viscount Bran. The following is a confession that I, Abanael Harish, known as Painter, when in the employ of the Inquisition, did betray our cause in exchange for promises of a title from the Venatory. I acknowledge the mercy of the Inquisition in allowing me my life in exchange for the secrets of the enemy, who I have now forsworn, and I willingly reserve my sentence in prison. Abanael Harish, as witnessed by Liana. That's good. The Inquisition is a sight to behold, a command of legions, hearts and minds. It is worthy, your Inquisitor is worthy, and my masters are pleased. I will bring my wares, and together we will extend your reach ever further. Now you trade, you tra now you trade not just in treasures, but in will. The esteemed Ferris the representative. Little blah blah. Let it by messenger bird. My, si my name is Sister Paulette. My sisters and I have been accompanying a handful of injured Inquisition soldiers through the Frostbacks. As they are no longer able to fight for the Inquisition, they wish to return to their families in Ferelden. In strange times, and many seek the solace or forgiveness of loved ones. Unfortunately, that peace may never come. A band of Avar, refusing to see a reason, have pinned us down. We have taken refuge in a cave and are holding them off as best as we can, but I don't know how long we can last. I understand this bird is trying to return to Skyhold. I pray it is so. We need aid. Soldiers dispatched from Skyhold so will not reach them in time. We should have men near the location within the party to pursue a group of red Templars who expect to move capture civilians to one of their red lyrian mines. A swift bird might reach the party, allowing them to go to the sister's aid. However, we will likely we will likely lose Templars' trail. No one wants to make this call, but if the Red Templars to escape, more people will be harmed, our soldiers would understand. The soldiers are still our allies. They've done their part, but cannot abandon them. I think we go with Josephine. Inquisitor. I have moved some of my agents into Kerponar, the pro fortress in Crestwood. At the moment, the villagers refers to the bandits, and it is an ex excellent waypoint from Pharrell into all A. We can make it a rendezvous point for messengers carrying sensitive information from either country. You're familiar with the caves underneath Crestwoods? They run for miles and if we excavate some passages, our agents could easily enter and exit the keep without being seen. Inquisitor. Uh. Uh.
Get a coin, scout no stand of trade, though it could become one in time. The Inquisition is largely driven by the belief of its supporters, some of whom are quite wealthy. But if it is to grow, it will need access to the coin of its own. The war between Navarra and Tevenda. Both Tevenda and Navarra were fighting against Venatori and Trenta along the border. The battle, no signs of abating until the Christian assaults. Uh, let's see. In investigate the strange chalk mine. Based on revelation at Haven that Venator represents revolt to Darkspawn, believed to be the Magister Griffiths, threat assessment of possible Venatori have been reprioritized as vital. Alright. Go take care of that. Alright. That will have to do. <sighs> right, so first things first. Um there is a lady in in Valvorier, who wants to hear of her lover. I remember that. So let's just go there first. Uh, tell her about it and leave to do Cassandra's thing. Oops. Yes, thank you. Um, then we can, uh, yeah, then we can go do Cassandra's thing. I think for Cassandra's thing we're bringing um, only, almost want to say only uh, only tanks, just because I think it's going to be hard. Also because it's been a while since we brought Blackwall and Iron Bull with us. I know we haven't been br bringing Varric and Sarah and Cole with us a lot, but I. Since I'm a mage, I do not really have the opportunity to bring rogues as much as I would like to. Mages at least have the damage output I need, but rogues... Mm, rogues are cool and all, but... They do not have quite the exact same of utility that a mage has, uh, and they are more likely to die. They're like class cannons, and I can't really use... I have no need for class cannons, I really can't use them. Mages at least have, have revive spells and the like. Did that guy just fall over? What the hell? Alright. What an unexpected pleasure. You must have had a long journey to the city. Might there be any news from this house? Here's a letter from Ellerly. He's safe with his family in the Dales. Oh, my Ellerly. Oh, bless you. The Dions will sponsor the Duparakets as a family deserving of a noble title, Inquisitor. You have my word. Now, please forgive my hastiness. But I must read Ellery's words. Make her keep you. Alright, so now we just have to find a way to meet Belize. We'll do that when Josephine is free. Quest map. World map. Promise of destruction. Travel. Yes. Hmm. Actually, on second thought, maybe... No! Tanks! Let's do this. I said I would only bring tanks, I'm only bringing tanks. Most holy, the Seekers are well aware of the part you played in the Revillian. Alright, cool. Um, I've been wanting to 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 replay um, Dragon Age Two because, uh, and a lot of you who have been watching this series have probably noticed this: is 
uh, I played Origins recently, but I have not actually played Dragon Age 2 since, since it was new, and I only played it for once. He might simply be a victim as well. Let's see what lies within. Yeah, but 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 I, I, it's been a while since I, I played Dragon Age 2, and I think since I do not have the same memory of the game, I might be doing myself a grand disservice. Uh, since this is a direct direct successor. Uh, okay. There's nothing up here. Why? Sacks. Elf fruit. Always use more elf fruit. Locking stands. I have yet to find a single locking stand. I wouldn't know where to look for one. All right. Let's check. The ch change the active quest. It makes no sense to still have that dark spawn thing. Uh, I think it's the inner circle. Promise of destruction. There we go. Here we go. All right, um, though. Oh shit! Promises. Well, that is not the word seekers, at least. What the hell are these? Make it take you. Promises. What the hell is a promiser? Move. Let's see what promises. Am I supposed to know what these are? Ah, jeez. See, this is why I want to tank. Ah. Oh. oh man, these look. Are these Templars? Just knight dudes, I guess. Knight, some sort of knight order. One dungeon key. Promises. I should have known. The order of fiery promise is a cult with. Strange beliefs about the Seekers. They've hounded us for centuries. What kind of strange beliefs? They believe they are Seekers. The only rightful ones. They say we robbed their powers long ago, preventing them from ending the world. Ending the world? The only way to truly eradicate evil in their eyes, the world will be reborn a paradise. It's all nonsense. That is very weird. Why haven't the Seekers dealt with them? We have, many times. They simply reappear after a time like weeds. Nobody knows how. Well, that could be Corypheus then. Cultists? Why am I not surprised? This explains why the Seekers might be here, but not the connection to Corypheus. Well, maybe Corypheus is bringing them back. Just to piss you guys off, weaken you? Take your mind off whatever he's doing. I mean, he's been around for a while. Then again, he's been sealed away most of the time, hasn't he? As I said, I haven't played Dragon Age 2 for quite a while. I haven't actually played the DLC other than Sebastian. I had Sebastian, so I don't really know where. That's a dead seeker. Did they torture him to death? The promises will pay for this. Oh shit. And this is your order, Cassandra. Crap. Cassandra, I hate to say it, but I think they might all be dead. Gold. Hey. Huh. Kill it. Bam, 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 bam.
Ah, oh, jeez. Uh. There we go. Take that. Shielding, I guess. All right. A valve raider. This is starting to change quite a bit. Where's the Lord of the Castle? Is he really implemented in this? That seems a bit strange. And I mean, thinking of of Al Hov, I guess that it isn't really that strange. The hell is that? Ah, uh, some sort of ah. Uh, that's a dead. Uh, fuck, I don't remember what they're called. Is it dead one of those? Oh, that's sad. What's in here? Still no key. That's a bit weird. Key. Oh man. Move! God damn it. You're in the way. Mm. This is strange though. This is meant to imply. This one? There we go. Cut your key. As the seekers of truth have proven resistant to the effects of Red Lyrium, the Elder One has seen fit to place them in your care. Reclaim your destiny, and know that the Elder One expects your devotion as repayment. Signed by Lord Samson, Commander of the Red Templars. Does Corypheus not realize the promises want the world to end? What use are they to him? Griffius will probably betray them before they get their chance. But after he gets what he needs out of them. But this doesn't explain how he captured the Seekers in the first place, or what's been done with them. We must keep looking. The letter said Seekers were resistant to Red Lyrium. Our abilities grant us many gifts, but a resistance to Red Lyrium's corruption. That seems strange. Although it would explain why none have numbered among the Red Templars. And thus, Seekers would be useless to Corypheus. He would have no leash to hold us. Do you really want to keep looking? What we find might not be pleasant. I do not shy away from unpleasant things. I must know. Alright. You said it yourself, then. I think we're finishing this mission. I uh, don't think it's very much longer, so... I think we're finishing this uh, mission before before we end the episode. Uh oh. Ah, oh, jeez. Hey, magic shielding. Comes me. Holy crap! Iron Ball, you're getting your ass kicked over there. Ah. 
Oh hey Colin, thank you for noticing me. Hey, you're about to... About ready to come in. That's cool. Evan it wool. Hmm. So he was just sitting there. Ever knitting. Ever knitting. He could never stop knitting. Oh, no. there we go. Why didn't he want to walk? He was just knitting all his life. Ugh. Oh, weird. What a fire promise. I'll read this later. Something, something destroy the world. Uh What's over here? He was just sitting there ever knitting. He couldn't stop knitting! Knitting! Oh hey, what's there? Cut crystal lion. I'll cut your crystal lion. Um is that perverse? Guess it is. Daniel! Daniel! Can you hear me? Oh, hey, you look like everyone else. Is you. You're alive. As are you. I'm so glad I found you. No, they put a, a demon inside me. It's tearing me up. You don't look what? exactly like the dude that That's sent impossible. me into the future. I'm not. Possessed. Are you related? They oh, does this game not just only have five character models? The promises will pay for what they've done. No. The Lord Seeker. Of course we'll find him. If he lives, we'll... Lucius betrayed us, Cassandra. He sent us here. One by one. An important mission, he said. Lies. Holy he crap, the cut scene is only 30 frames per second. He's still working with them. Sorry. <laughs> but we met Lord Seeker Lucius in Val Royale. He couldn't have been here. That wasn't him. It was a demon. Masquerading. Well, to be fair, Vault Vilfra, that was that weeks be? ago. Even in game, Lord I think. Seeker allowed it. He let the demon take command. He could have just popped out to meet you. Came here. If we find the Lord Seeker, he's dead. Wait. Don't leave me like this, please. Ah, oh, this is up to you, you Zora. Come with me. You didn't believe in the war any more than I did. You know me. I wanted that promotion. <coughs> Go to the maker's side, Daniel. You will be welcome. <sighs> he was my apprentice. I have never known a finer young man. Now we find Lord Seeker Lucius. Well, we do it next time. Thank you guys for watching this episode of Hunk for Plays. It was longer than I expected it to be. I hope you enjoyed it. Hope you join next time for more shenanigans. Until then, bye!